Come on, everybody. Here we go. Off to Weberland. Hi, friends. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to our podcast. I'm Kristen. And I'm Ryan. We are Adventures in Weberland, episode 28. Mm-hmm. Closer to 30. Closer, closer to 30, to the yeah. midlife crisis. Wait, that's 40. That's 40. <gasps> Whoops. <laughs> that's a little scary. Okay, yeah. Let's, let's uh, a 40. Yeah. <laughs> what? 40 or 50. Over the hill is 50. No. Oh, I don't mm-hmm. know. I don't know. I <laughs> feel like between crisis. forty and fifty, you yeah, have your midlife that's crisis, right? right? That's true. Um, before we before we start, mm-hmm. um, I want to talk about um, Hurricane Milton oh, that came okay. in, and just want to say that you know anyone um, mm-hmm. you know that was affected or anything like that, we're obviously thinking about you. We were yes. thinking about um, all of Florida. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, the, the West Coast got hit pretty hard. We know a lot of people down in the Tampa area. Yeah. Uh, close friends, um, old coworkers. Mm-hmm. Um, so, you know, uh, thinking a lot about uh, everyone that was mm-hmm. affected by that. Yeah, and two years ago we went, we were there uh, when Irene came through. No, was no, it? Hurricane Ian. Oh, Ian. Oh, Irene, no. Sorry, <laughs> I got it mixed up. But we, uh, thank you for correcting me because I was wrong. But um, yeah, we we were there, so yeah, uh, we know kind of a little bit about what Disney also is very prepared usually during these. So. Yeah, I think um, Milton hit Disney World the way it, the way Ian did, mm-hmm. um, but. You know, the, the the Tampa area and, you know, Fort Myers and, and, and mm-hmm. you know, obviously it was a more broad yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, area that got hit worse mm-hmm. than um, Central Florida did. But, yeah, there's still mm-hmm. people without power. Yeah. Um, but Disney World really knows how to take care of you if you are in that sure. situation. Yeah. Um, so, you know, mm-hmm. hopefully if you were there during mm-hmm. that time, um, mm-hmm. you know, everything turned out okay. Um, yeah. So, yeah, it's it's pretty devastating um it was yeah. a, it was a bad hurricane oh yeah you know we had sandy hit uh years mm. ago up here in new oh, jersey God. yeah that was horrible. yeah so mm. um so yes uh thinking about everybody that mm. was affected and and you know hopefully um everything is okay mm. and you know power is back and mm. all that kind of stuff yep. so i i am really upset with some of this news coming out here yeah what are we gonna do we got some crazy disney world news uh, that just popped up. So I actually have one of them open because mm-hmm. I. Um, so they're going to start the transformation of Dino Land. That's yep. going to happen January 12th, as of January 12th, 2025. Mm-hmm. That will be the last day to experience Triceratops Spin, wow. Fossil Fun Games, mm-hmm. and Chester and Hester's Dinosaur Treasures. Oh, wow. But Dinosaur, the ride, mm-hmm. and other Dino Land favorites are going to remain open for now, according to Chip and Co. Okay. So, yeah, they're starting the transformation yeah. of getting rid of Dino Land, which wow. is a little upsetting Big to me. Move. I am biased. I love Donald Duck, and that's, mm-hmm. his, that's his thing, yeah. right? Uh, but I'm very excited for what's mm-hmm. to come. Yeah, me too. And especially Indiana Jones, mm-hmm. I'm excited for. Yeah. But, you know, I feel like it just wasn't Disney when you were there at that in that section with all the games and stuff but i i understand why they had it Mm -hmm. but at the same time yeah you know i don't know i think it's going to be great it's a great uh a great uh thing to transfer the dino land to you know like what what it's going to end up being yeah yeah and i think you know for for anyone going between Mm -hmm. now and january 12th if you want to experience dino land as is Mm -hmm. uh that would be the time to do it Mm -hmm. uh again you know certain things are still going to remain open but Mm -hmm. you know so maybe that's something we put on our list yes um another thing that you're probably going to want to do uh between now and i want to say january 5th or 6th it's like soon yeah is ride big thunder mountain yep as of January 5th or 6th, I can't remember the exact day, uh, mm-hmm. but it was one of those days. It's going to close for a whole year. Wow. So any People pretty, are going to miss that. Yeah, pretty much all of 2025, if mm-hmm. you're going, you won't be able to ride uh, Big Thunder Mountain. I think it had to be done. 
Yeah, so but. so before any of that news was was released and everyone was speculating what was going to happen beyond that or mm. before D23 even happened, you know, uh, the permits became public that they were going to be working on something yes. with Big Thunder Mountain. Mm-hmm. So so clearly this was expected, this mm-hmm. was coming. Yeah. You mm-hmm. know, are they working on the ride? Are they working on the area to start cars? Are they mm-hmm. working on the area to start you know, villains land. I don't know. We don't know. I, yeah. You know, but but something's Man. happening. You're not going to be able to ride it for a whole year. So mm-hmm. I think they're going to do some refurb, but then I think mm-hmm. they're also going to work on an entrance yeah. or a pathway to towards yeah. uh, towards the villains land. Yeah, I think with that closure is going to come more mm-hmm. news. You yeah. know, um, eventually. You know, it's 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 going to start to become a busy time mm-hmm. down there with the holidays. Oh yeah. And then, you know, after marathon weekend, mm-hmm. which is actually a little later this coming marathon weekend is usually right after new year's. Yeah. Um, so this is closing during that time. I think January mm-hmm. 8th around whatever that weekend is, is when marathon weekend yeah. is happening. Uh, and that's just, it kind of, I want to say calms down. Yeah. It calms down from the <laughs> hype of Chris from Christmas. Yeah. But is it, there's no more off season no. in Disney world anymore. There used obviously. To be. Um, so yeah, big news. Yeah. That's big some news. big stuff happening. Yeah. yeah and, uh, and, uh, I think, what we're talking about today, mm-hmm. there's going to be once they build Villains Land, mm-hmm. there's going to be tons of photo opportunities. Yes, <laughs> yes, and it might change our mind about what we're going to talk about. That's true. Eventually. That's very true. So we um, we're the type of family that we have like um, certain like photos we want to take. Yes, while we're on vacation, and mm-hmm. we were discussing that, and mm-hmm. you know, we were talking about like our favorite spots and. Mm-hmm. You know our favorite attractions. Yeah. You know that have photo pass. So why not make an episode about it, right, right, Ryan? Yes. <laughs> why not? Because I think that people all have their go tos. Yeah. And like you know, we thought each park deserves one really good one. Yeah. So um, we'll, we'll talk about each park, right? And yeah. So we're gonna tell you our favorite photo pass mm-hmm. uh, in each park. Yeah, yeah. That's that's what we're doing. I think it's cool because like you know. Some of them are hard to mm-hmm. pick from because mm-hmm. I actually think Hollywood Studios I'm having a little trouble. Okay. Because there's a couple, there's like three really good ones. I think. Yeah. So mm-hmm. it's hard to pick your favorite, but um, you know, I also I think I take into account like oh, I you can't get this picture anywhere else, mm-hmm. or you know, it's just too cool to pass up, and or it's just something that means something. Yeah special well, yeah and i mean we can talk about our favorites mm-hmm. but we can also t- you know mm-hmm. which one is our favorite in particular in each park yeah. but we can also kind of pinpoint other ones that that we like yeah. throughout the parks because mm-hmm. there are you have to remember too with each season comes mm-hmm. different kinds of photo passes right yeah. mm-hmm. so like for it's halloween true. for instance That's let's take true. that one mm-hmm. especially with the magic shots and if you're mm-hmm. not familiar with that if you well actually if you're not familiar with photo pass in mm-hmm. general what yeah. it is is there are certain areas throughout each park or even mm-hmm. disney springs they have it too mm-hmm. and even sometimes they have it at your resort depending yeah. on what resort you're staying at you want to look for a cast member that has a green shirt because mm-hmm. They change the color now. Yeah. They're wearing like a, I don't want to say a lime green. It's just a green, a, yeah, bit. a green shirt that has a professional camera. Mm-hmm. And that's considered a Disney photo pass photographer. Mm-hmm. And what they do is they will take your picture professionally. And if you purchase the memory maker, it'll automatically go into your album. Mm-hmm. Or you can, uh, if you don't purchase the memory maker, you can just purchase photos, you know, yeah. individually as well. Um, you know, in our opinion, the memory maker is worth the price. Definitely. Um, if you become an annual pass holder or you are an annual pass holder, there is an mm. option for you to add it on. It used to be included. <laughs> that's true. But it's <laughs> not anymore. Well, that's how they, you know, <laughs> they got to make their money back when they were closed somehow. I feel yeah. like that's part of it. So Yeah. So anytime you see, uh, you know, any of the cast members with that green shirt and a, and a camera, you know, you can ask them to take your picture. They'll mm-hmm. scan your magic band or they'll scan your um, your card, you know, mm-hmm. your ticket. Uh, and, and it'll come up on your My Disney Experience app or on your account if you mm-hmm. log on to the website. You don't have to get this done, um, mm-hmm. but it is a, it's something special, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, so a magic shot, what, what that is, is 
when you're I'm gonna I'm just gonna use Cinderella's castle, Cinderella yep. Castle for as okay. an example. If you want to get your picture taken by a, a Disney photo pass photographer in front of the castle, they might ask you to do something a little weird. Mm -hmm. Maybe stick your hand out, you yeah. know, so it, as if something's going to sit on your hand or point to the sky and look surprised. And that's considered a magic shot. And what they're mm -hmm. doing is they're pressing a little button on their on their uh, mm -hmm. keypad there uh, to enter a code. And what you're pointing at in the sky and looking surprised might mm -hmm. be Tinkerbell. Yeah. Or, figment. you know, Figment, right? Mm -hmm. At Epcot, they do Figment, right? Mm -hmm. We've gotten that one yeah. before. So those are considered magic shots. Yeah. And depending on the season, they they will do Halloween, for instance, right? They'll mm -hmm. have some Halloween magic shots during the Halloween uh, party. Mm -hmm. uh, Christmas ones during the Christmas party. During Easter, they might do, you know, something like that as well. So it's always um, good to ask. Yeah. as well because sometimes they won't even offer it you can just say True. hey do you have a magic shot and they'll be like oh sure you know or whatever mm -hmm. so uh, those are usually cool and those usually uh go over well with the kids they do yeah, yeah. it's uh it's special oh, any photo is but you know i think like i like just uh there's there's so many options yes that makes it fun so. right because it's not just within the like within the park you know mm -hmm. standing in front of the castle or standing in front of spaceship earth but also the rides yeah right some of the rides mm -hmm. offer a photo pass as well yeah. so let's start in magic kingdom is that okay, okay? yes okay so mm -hmm. ryan yeah what is your favorite photo pass mm -hmm. in magic kingdom well i think it's gonna have to be where i proposed to you oh <laughs> and where was that that's right <laughs> so if you're facing the castle and you're looking you're right in front of walt the friendship is it called the friend the uh, partner statue partner statue yeah um why did i say friendship I don't i'm know. not sure <laughs> That's what I meant. partner <laughs> statue um to the right of it mm -hmm. in that circle area there's a photo pass there's one on each side mm -hmm. normally it's actually always a line uh, but we always try to get that picture yeah um but that's to me, that's the perfect spot. And when I actually researched it, when we I was going to propose, <laughs> and they said that's the perfect spot because it's the castle is the right size in the background, and you get the Walt statue and mm -hmm. everything. And so that's what I picked because you know it was recommended. So I think, uh, but I really think it's the perfect shot mm -hmm. in Magic Kingdom. So I um, love that answer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that's that's um a go to for a lot of people, right? Yeah. Everyone wants Walt, wants Mickey, and wants the castle yeah. all in the background, and it really is a magical shot. It mm -hmm. it's just so in any time of day, it doesn't matter. Like no. that kind of defines Disney World, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Um, they're usually usually two photo pass mm -hmm. yep. photographers in that area right in front of the the yeah. partner statue, one to the right and one to the yeah, left, like what, you said. Yeah, I'm saying, yeah. Um. I knew you were going to say that, <laughs> and that that's mine as well, but mm -hmm. I decided to pick something else okay. uh, because I knew you were going to say that. Yeah. I didn't want to have the same answer, but obviously that's sentimental to us, right? That's yeah. where you proposed. I had no idea. Mm -hmm. I was so shocked. There is and a video. Maybe one day we'll post <laughs> it. <laughs> you know what they said, too, is like the photographer will be taking pictures, and then if you hand them their, your phone, I had the video going. Mm -hmm. So we had photos and video mm -hmm. and made it even more special yeah for us so yeah. uh, i think i might know what your other one is but okay see. you go you let me see if you you might know because so again as i said in the beginning every trip we take mm. we have certain pictures yeah. that that we like to take and it's something that you know down the road in 10 15 20 years we want to look back and kind mm. of look at the evolution yeah. of not only our growth our mm. kids growth but also the park yeah. right right because mm -hmm. so changes. one picture that we take as a family every single trip and the best part is that like i think one year jagger was crying in it and i was like i can't wait to show him this in like 20 years or, like at his wedding pull it out mm -hmm. you know or whatever yeah um but it's right in front of the train station yep. right when you enter into magic mm -hmm. kingdom you scan your magic band and boom yeah there it is now there's not always a a um a photo pass photographer there That's nine true. times out of ten there is but not always. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that's something where if there's not, we'll just ask someone politely, you know, yeah. hey, do you mind taking our picture? And we've never had mm -hmm. anyone say no, which was yeah. very nice. And usually, like, if we, we'll go to Magic Kingdom Magic Kingdom a few times. Mm -hmm. So 
out of those few times, there's always usually a photo yeah. pass person. And that is also defined, to me, that defines Magic Kingdom and mm-hmm. Disney World, too, that photo. So yeah. that's a good choice, number yeah. two. And, and it's, again, depending on the season, it's mm-hmm. decorated according to the mm-hmm. season. And if yeah. you're lucky, you can get the train mm-hmm. parked right in front, too. That's true, yeah. Which is, which is a super cool shot mm-hmm. as well. So that's a traditional shot that we take every yeah. time we go. Um, another one that we started doing, and this is just a personal mm. one, are the kids. Uh, yeah. There is a, a picture that we started with both kids sitting, uh, well, because at the time, the first time we did it, Bowie couldn't sit up yet, so she's actually mm. sitting in between Jagger's mm-hmm. legs. Um, but it's right on the, the, the hub, right on the mm-hmm. green, with yep. the castle in the background. And the last one is pure <laughs> joy, because Bowie is hysterically mm. crying. Mm. She had it she yeah. was done but again in 10 15 20 years yep. it's gonna be really funny i also think that we should keep her in front of jagger in between his legs like that every <laughs> for time. forever yes. yeah yeah and i think also that that's a great spot mm-hmm. for them because and we actually had trouble figuring out where it was the last time yeah but, um I think that's just like the perfect thing to do every time because it's to see their growth. Yeah. You know? That's yeah. Great. So those are like personal ones yeah. that we like. You know, anything in front of the castle obviously mm-hmm. is just iconic. Uh, there is one more I want to touch on before mm-hmm. we move. I think I might know what it is. Okay. Go ahead if you know. The Haunted Mansion. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> if you yeah. don't know no. it's there, oh. it is the funniest mm-hmm. picture that will ever mm-hmm. come out yep so when you you enter on, mm-hmm. onto the doom buggy and you're starting the ride mm-hmm. right now when you you enter the very first room you're going to see a bunch of pictures on yep. the wall portraits on the wall mm-hmm. and there's going to be a flashing light because it's lightning right yep. you're going to hear the thunder but it's not lightning mm-hmm. it's the flash of the camera that's right it is the last portrait mm-hmm. on the wall it's kind of like orangey red. It's the lady. Is it it's like a lady, a lady like, laying? Yeah. It's the last sideways. one. Remember that. Because yeah. nobody does. Mm-hmm. And those pictures are absolutely we know. hilarious. And Jagger, I get, I look scared, Jagger. And then we take it and every time it's uh, funny. So right. he actually has it in a frame in his room. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so, it's, it's cute. Um, that, was, that would be like my, I think that's my third favorite. Mm-hmm. For, I think second for me is out front. And third would be Haunted Mansion. Yeah. So I think those three, and, and then also them on the green. Like, we can't miss those four. So mm-hmm. that's a lot, actually. <laughs> but yeah. Magic Kingdom has so many places and so many, yeah. like, beautiful shots, um, even from the side of the castle, from the back of the castle. Yeah. There's so many things you could do. When the wishing well is open, that's a mm-hmm. great shot yeah. as well. There are, there are hidden areas, too. Mm-hmm. Like, if you go um, where sleep, like, as if you're walking towards... Um, Liberty Square Mm -hmm. from the castle, right? So you're standing in front of the castle. If you walk towards Liberty Square, you're going to see Sleepy Hollow on the right-hand side. Yeah. Um, Make a right... Mm-hmm. So then Sleepy Hollow would be on your left. You're going to go around the castle almost, but yeah. don't don't fully go around the castle. Right next to Sleepy Hollow, along the railing, mm-hmm. if you stand in front of the railing with the castle in the background, mm-hmm. you'll get the perfect shot with yeah. nobody back with there. With nobody, yeah. Because nobody can walk back there. Yeah, some people it's, too. It's they, the water. they wait till it closes and and get great shots mm-hmm. too with nobody in the background. Yeah. Um, I also like. I really want to just mention this: the Seven Doors Mine Train <sighs> is such a cool photo pass like thing on your app mm-hmm. because it's like you're on the like they basically show you on the ride and it's not even a photo really; it's a video right. of you on the ride. I totally so forgot cool. about that. Yeah, very cool. very good, Ryan. Yeah, mm-hmm. I totally forgot about that. Well, I remember because really cool. Jagger just went on, and I wanted to see his face. Yeah, he doesn't want to go on it again. <laughs> he will later. Yeah, it was good to get him, uh, you know, accustomed to yeah. it. So, so yeah, Magic Kingdom is as full mm-hmm. of. I mean, it's real. That really the hardest one to choose yeah. the right thing. Yeah. So, you want to go on to another park? Yeah, you want to okay. do Animal Kingdom? Yeah, let's do Animal Kingdom. Okay. Uh, obviously, the whole entire park is amazing, mm-hmm. right? I mean, how do it's you? True. I, 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 I have, I, I thought about it, but you know, I, I don't know. Okay, well, I, I have, I have two. Okay, I have two. Um, classic Pandora, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Uh, 
all of Pandora. I love Pandora. I love Animal Kingdom. I'm mm-hmm. that weirdo that that really loves to go to Animal Kingdom. I'd rather mm-hmm. spend my time in Animal Kingdom than Hollywood Studios. Believe it or not, weird, mm-hmm. right? Um, but Pandora is just so gorgeous, and and especially at night. But even if you don't catch it at night, mm-hmm. if you walk near like where the big rocks are and yep. the waterfall, the waterfall. I was gonna um, say it is my favorite. Yeah, so. that it, there's mm-hmm. usually again nine times out of ten there is a photo pass photographer mm-hmm. there. Uh, and it's a great shot. And sometimes you have that magic shot mm-hmm. where there's a banshee flying That's true. Uh, behind <laughs> you or in front of you or whatever. Um, it is just such a mm. cool shot. And something, like you said, you cannot see or take anywhere mm-hmm. else. Nope. And the it's just incredible what they built for Pandora. Mm-hmm. So it's just everywhere you look, you can take a beautiful photo. Yeah. So I also like the Tree of Life. If you really look up close, it's all carved in animals and it's another incredible shot Mm -hmm. and you can actually take the photo pass when the birds are flying too that's even better with the tree of life yeah that's right and that's almost like magic kingdom where they have the two photographers one on each side yeah you it goes kind of quickly i'm always afraid i'm gonna get pooped on yeah well, with those birds it's possible i know i'm <laughs> i know it is they're pretty smart though i don't know yeah well they they're very know, well trained they might yeah. have to go they know that they're trained like to go in the porta potty or something oh, I don't, that's a lot that's <laughs> saying a lot um, no but jagger has been pooped on before oh let's not <laughs> talk about that and it was in animal kingdom yeah Oh my god, how yeah. embarrassing. It was more on the stroller than on him. <laughs> so what happened was this was his first trip. So he mm-hmm. was seven months old. Yeah. And our stroller has, you know, mm. I think every stroller, I'm pretty sure every stroller has this, right? Yeah. Uh we had the um how the, we, the cover. Yeah, the, we had the, the cover pr- over the sun protector. Thing. Yes. Yeah. And and when you when you fold it, mm-hmm. there's like the netting so you yeah. can see inside. Well the netting was was out. Thank God. <laughs> and, and uh a bird pooped mm-hmm. and it went through. Yeah. We had to change him. <laughs> was on his forehead. But that's good luck, apparently. On his chest. It was oh, it felt so bad. The poor thing. I think we've all been bird pooped on before. yeah yeah I have. and exactly it's supposed to be good luck yeah. but i felt really bad yeah well then he got his full animal kingdom experience <laughs> <got that> right. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah. okay so another mm-hmm. another shot uh that i think is really cool mm-hmm. is when i'm trying to think of the best way mm-hmm. To walk there, so you can get to what I'm talking about. It's in Asia. Mm-hmm. Um, the, you can either get there from Africa, so you can walk from Africa to Asia, or you can get there from uh, Discovery Island, right, yeah. from where the tree is. Uh, and when you walk into Asia, right where the monkeys are, mm-hmm. there's like a little area that you can stand that behind you would be, you know, where that stadium where they had the like the Rivers of Lights yeah. and they mm-hmm. had the kite show and yeah, all of yeah. that. And then Everest Mm -hmm. behind you. And it's an awesome shot because, again, not a lot of people behind you unless they're sitting in that stadium, which it's so far away, you can't really tell what it is. That's true. I know you're talking about. Mm Yeah, but to have that, like, the the snow cap mountain Mm -hmm. behind you of Everest, it's a really cool shot. It is cool. I like that. This one, I really like that. It's not really a photo pass, though, Mm -hmm. because there's no professional photographer, Mm -hmm. but Kevin walking around and getting that selfie when trying to get a selfie (laughs) with Kevin from Up um, and and Divine, both of them. I wish they had photo pass for them because it would be really cool to get photos with uh, Divine is like the... How do you the explain vine. her? The vine. <laughs> the vine. She just blends She's in. She's a human vine that walks the, around. Yeah. And it's oh, usually around very the unique. Yes. When you walk in. Yeah. So like those two, I, it's, it's fun because I know Tr- Jagger, Kevin, Kevin. He's just like yelling, trying to get <laughs> his attention. Yeah. And But to get a picture, they're always funny. Mm-hmm. Because you got the selfie and you got him with the beak and he's, uh, you know, yeah. it's perfect. I, we have that. I'm actually going to post a couple of these pictures that we're talking mm-hmm. about on our on okay. our social media, yeah. on Instagram or Facebook. And that'll be one of them. I'll yeah. make sure to include that because it's really funny. I think that's it, though, for Animal Kingdom. I don't know. Well, any Animal, Animal Kingdom is just so beautiful. Like, you can mm-hmm. really take a good picture anywhere. Yeah. But for, yeah, for photo pass wise, those are my favorite. Those yeah. two are my favorite. Mm-hmm. Um, and like you said, you know, getting that picture in front of the Tree of Life. Um mm-hmm. Just any of the icons, right? The park icons is is, it, is something that Jagger you did. Do. Um, he loved the Doug. Oh, Doug! Yeah. Uh, photo op too, because yeah. Doug was really cool because mm-hmm. you can like you hear him talk and stuff yeah. like with the 
I think he says some things. I, I thought he did, anyway. Well, the cool thing, too, is, is and this was a long time ago, we got pictures with Launchpad, mm-hmm. Scrooge oh, that, McDuck. Oh, yeah, I remember those. Remember those? Those, those are, are really rare. great, too. Yeah. Oh, I forgot all about that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we did that. That mm-hmm. was in, But that was in Dino Land. You that's were, true. Yeah, now that's so. going to, yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> those will be. Those, are the, those aren't there like anymore. But Rarities now. Yeah. yeah. So. So. Okay. Uh, let's do. You pick the park. Mm, Hollywood Studios. Let's, let's do, go to Epcot. Hollywood. Okay, okay. there are this a is, couple. Yep, this is a hard one. But if I had to pick my favorite, favorite number one, I'm mm. going classic. Okay. Sunset Boulevard mm. at night. I thought so. Right in front of the Tower of Terror. <laughs> That's the first you thing to. that came through my head. So and then like, the second thing was in front of the Millennium Falcon, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> but then exactly. I said, you know what? It has to be the Millennium Falcon for me, but it has to be down below, Mm -hmm. like level with the Millennium Falcon, Mm -hmm. with your lightsaber. Yes. And like at night. Yes. I agree. Because there's nothing like it. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing, even if you're not a Star Wars fan, it's cool. Like you got the bright light from the lightsaber, you just, you feel like a Jedi. Mm -hmm. And like, to me, that's like an amazing shot. Like they built a Millennium Falcon. Like to me, it's just crazy. Life size. It's crazy. (laughs) Um, and, uh, like, again, I like Star Wars. It's not, like, the, my favorite, favorite movie, but I still enjoy it. Sure. But, like, it's, inc- it's, it is starting to become more of a favorite, but, um, like, it's just a cool shot. Mm-hmm. But, like, again, there's nothing like the Hollywood Tower of Terror either in the background on Sunset Boulevard. So, that, that was a hard pick for me. Yeah. And I really liked the Runaway Railway shot, too, actually. That was, like, my third one. Like, you mean but, in front of the Chinese theater? Yeah, or? in front of the theater. And, like, you know, you have the neon sign now. I don't know. Yeah. I really liked taking that. Uh, yeah. We did, we did it before. There's always a photo pass photographer, mm-hmm. um, even close up to yeah. the, um, the Chinese theater. Mm-hmm. Um, but, obviously all down hollywood boulevard too there's mm. like a bunch of them just just like the other parks right uh when once you get to that like main mm. area that main street if you will yeah. uh there's there's always a ton of photo pass photographers so you can't miss it um i think another cool thing that that they have um a photo pass for is uh, around echo lake mm. and personally i like it during christmas time because yeah. the tree is there and the decorations mm-hmm. are there and i know you have a picture with bowie mm-hmm. um, but they bring characters out and yep. it's right against echo lake it's so cool. that's what's your background right yeah. gertie and and if it's christmas time it's the tree yeah uh they've had max goof yep. we've we seen did, chip and dale took with, uh, yeah. our picture with max goof yeah. and there's usually not a very long line no. like if you wait 10 minutes maybe 15 mm-hmm. minutes uh, I think that is uh, a great photo pass. I wish uh, Roger, well. Roger Rabbit was there. But oh, wow. I would love that. I don't think they've done Christmas that. Christmas time. How long? Well, I see him in the sing along songs. That, we that was from the early 90s. Like. <laughs> well, that's when it came out. <laughs> I but know, but. The, that would be cool. Yeah. But, um, yeah. I, I also thought about this too. It was like, I like that, what you're saying, but I also love uh, Darth Vader. Like, we had so much fun with him. Oh, that's true. And Jaguar was scared, but they get scared and they don't, whatever. But, but like, they end up liking it mm-hmm. at the end of it. But, like, it's just so cool to walk in and he's there and he's talking. And, like, that's a very unique thing, too. Because where else can you get a picture with, with you know, yeah. a real, like, legit? Well, that's the thing, too, that I get scared of thing. because that might go away. It's depending true. on what they're going to do with, mm-hmm. you know, the Monsters, Inc. area yeah. and all of that. You know, if they touch... Mm-hmm. Um, that area that uh you know i don't know i I think if you do you know star tours there's probably a somewhere around there they can still put darth vader and chewbacca and bb8 star tours yes but darth vader doesn't Mm -hmm. belong in galaxy's edge because it's past that's what i'm saying star tours they could add to that section i don't think i don't know where it's all going but Mm -hmm. we'll see but i i Right now, it might yeah, it might become a rarity too. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that that part changes so much. But that's true. Uh, if cool. you have kids, actually, speaking of mm-hmm. uh, that uh, that area, uh, down by the Disney Junior Dance Party, there are um, what do you call them? I guess like photo ops, right? Mm-hmm. That are set up. There is Pluto, mm-hmm. Vampirina, mm-hmm. Doc McStuffins, or no? I think so. Is Doc McStuffins yeah. out there? Mm-hmm. And what's the other one? 
Fancy or, Nancy? Fancy Nancy. Is that right? Yeah, I think so. I think that's right. I think those they are the switch four. Around. But Pluto's sure. always there. I see yeah. Chip and Dale always walking by, too. Yeah. <laughs> but but those are actual, the... like, photo ops, and there's yeah. always a, a photo pass photographer. So for the kids, mm-hmm. um, you might want to check that out. That It's fun. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's good. I think that's good for Hollywood Studios. Yeah. Right? Epcot, uh, see, Epcot was hard for me. Oh, that's easy for me. <laughs> what do you think I'm going to say? Big man. Yep. We waited years <laughs> to bring figment back years that's a good point and he's back and he's big and he's he, huge and it's an awesome background and he goes into this like portal thing <laughs> and comes back out and whoever played figment the one time <laughs> is sealed the deal for me because yeah. he was amazing yeah um not all of them are like that mm-hmm. but i mean it couldn't be in a per- more perfect spot too when you get out of figment i don't know that and, and Spaceship Earth mm-hmm. photo op. Obviously. And, like, if you take it from Japan, it's really cool, too. Like, But they don't well, have usually have a photo pass person there. Yeah, but. that's that's the thing. So mm-hmm. I but, like taking pictures in mm-hmm. each country. You just have to find the photo pass photographer. And yeah. if there's not one, again, just ask someone mm-hmm. nicely and they'll take it for you. Mm-hmm. It's it's cool to document, you know, yourself mm-hmm. in each in each country. Um but I know you I, I was I have a guess of uh, what you're going to say. Go ahead. I think it's Mexican uh the Mexico Mexico the Donald in Donald Mexico. Donald photo up. So that was that's my second. Oh, okay. That's I was my wrong. second. I went a little personal. Okay. But I also think it's a really cool shot for mm-hmm. for anyone that likes like the scenic look, mm-hmm. right? Okay. Uh, so there is a spot now. There's not always a photo pass photographer. Mm-hmm. Uh, sometimes oh, I don't okay. even want to say nine times out of ten because it's not nine times out of ten. It's like <laughs> half the time you're there, there'll be somebody there. Yes. Um, because a lot of the times we take it ourselves, mm-hmm. but it's just the backdrop. Yep. The backdrop is so amazing. So. It's just, it's near Figment. I know what you're talking about now. Yeah. Um, so where the Pixar shorts are, if you go, you know, you go up those stairs, don't go into the building. Uh, you're going to see the little fountains uh, with the water that mm-hmm. kind of skips, right? Mm-hmm. To, and then you're going to see the the backwards waterfall, yeah. right? Or fo- water mm-hmm. up. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. It goes backwards. It comes up. It doesn't go down. Mm-hmm. Um, if you have your back to Spaceship Earth mm-hmm. and you're looking at the Pixar shorts, and you have someone take your photo. This is a a picture that Jagger and I have Mm -hmm. taken every single trip, and it's our mommy-son photo. Oh, I get emotional talking about it. (laughs) I I really do. I forgot about it. I am the photo pass uh, photographer for that. uh, We we haven't forgotten. (laughs) Every every trip, Jagger and Mm -hmm. I have one, and it's it's just so funny to to Mm -hmm. see... You know, his first trip when he was seven months old. Yep. And I still carry him. I still hold him, right, mm-hmm. in the picture. And he's getting really heavy um, to, to July, you know. Yep. So so from that trip, in, in from his shot. first trip to his last trip, it's it's so crazy just to see how big he's gotten just mm-hmm. in, you know, not even three years. I know. But anyway, um, it's Spaceship Earth in the mm-hmm. background with uh, the, the backwards waterfall. And if yep. you time it correctly... You can mm. get the monorail going mm. through. It is a beautiful shot. Yeah, I uh, agree with you. It's just, it's just so. Mm-hmm. I don't, I don't even know how to describe it. And again, maybe this is just a personal thing because it's Jagger and I's picture mm-hmm. together. But um, if you like that kind of backdrop, you yeah. know, that's that's a perfect spot. And again, time it right, you can get the monorail in there too. It reminds me of old old school epcot yeah mm-hmm. with the water and the figment and everything just there it just has that 80s vibe yeah. to it up there and it's so spaceship earth and you have that in the background so like to me you could have took that picture in the 80s and it would have looked the same yeah you know what i mean and yeah it's, but it's a beautiful shot perfect yeah perfect pick i mean i i i, I just uh Yours is better. <laughs> no, it's again, it's a personal thing, but yeah. but I really do feel like a lot of people like you know the mm-hmm. the the iconic shots like that. You know, characters yeah. are one thing, yes, and and I'll put I'll put Jagger's I'll I'll put our picture up there from when he his first trip seven months and our yeah, last Instagram. trip in July uh, when he was three up on our Instagram mm-hmm. along with all the other pictures I'm going to put up. And you but, can go to our Instagram, make sure they know where to go because they don't. Oh yeah, at Adventures in Wipperland, mm-hmm. yes. 
Um, I think another cool thing too, and this is exclusive if you have a um, Disney uh, Chase card, the, v- mm. the Visa card, mm. uh, is right. I'm going to stay in the same area here. Mm. Right next to Pixar Shorts is a building, mm. and when you walk in, all you have to do is show your card, your yep. your credit card. You don't have to uh, pay anything. There's no fee. You just have to prove that you have the card, mm-hmm. and you wait in a line, and it's a surprise meet and greet know, you don't cool. know who's going to be there until you are ready to take that picture um the last time i did it with bowie it was minnie and pluto mm-hmm. we did it once where it was like mickey goofy yeah maybe mickey, just mickey and goofy i don't remember uh, but it's really cool it's and it's, it's cute, cute to not know it's who hidden. it is it's it's very hidden you really mm-hmm. don't know it's there it's one of the secrets maybe we should do yeah. a an episode on some of the secrets there you go of uh Walt Disney World that yeah. people don't really know about I think the only rides in Epcot Guardians has a photo pass mm-hmm. Frozen yep. right before the drop mm-hmm. and what am I missing Test Track did right yeah well Spaceship Earth they take your picture well, but yeah. then it gets put into that story and then you can see yourself on the on the yeah. big screen. So that's sort of one. Yeah, but I don't think you can get that. Can no, you? no, yeah, I don't you think can't. So. That's not Unless something you, you take could... a picture of yourself. Yeah, you yeah. got to take a picture of yourself. Yeah, yeah. I don't think because Figment mm. doesn't have one. No. Oh, the in I'm front of, of in front of like um, Epcot when you walk in is also a great photo, and I think oh, that's 100%. the magic shot of Figment there. Yeah. And then they have the fountain now, so there's there's a lot of great opportunities. Yeah, mm-hmm. I don't think Nemo doesn't have one. Uh, the land doesn't. Soren doesn't. Right, that's what I'm. Test track. That's what so, I'm saying. Yeah. Test track. But... Now we'll see what the new test track brings, which I'm kind of excited about. Yeah. It says next year, I think, too. Yeah. So. It'll be fun. Yeah, I mean, I think doing this, you create. I think it's totally worth the money. Mm-hmm. Memory maker is yes. Because I agree. you have these pictures forever, and they're always really good shots. Mm-hmm. And you could take your own too, so you have your own, and you have these, and I think it just. You know, we learned something, though, too. Make sure, I think it's like 45 days or something. What did the one photographer told us? That, like, they don't stay on there as long as we thought anymore. So make sure you t- you always save your photos. Because yeah, download on them. The photo pass, because you don't want to lose them. But I think you can get them back if you really, really need to. I think the 45 days is for, so if you, so for instance, mm-hmm. for, like us, right? Yeah. We have annual passes. Mm-hmm. But only one of us, which I think it was me, yeah. purchased uh, the memory maker because it's a hundred dollars, right? Yeah. We both don't we're, no, we're, we don't we're together yeah, we <laughs> anyway. But they can still scan your magic band and it'll mm. go to our account. But because your magic band was scanned, it doesn't last as long. I see. That's what it is because mm-hmm. it's normally but, a year yeah. expiration. That's a little hidden thing though, so just be yeah. careful. So also, a- if you're on, let's say, a ride or you do take a picture mm-hmm. in front of something and you know, yes, they scan your magic band, but something went wrong and your uh-huh. picture's not there. You get another family's photos. Mm. You can go to, you know, guest services at mm-hmm. each park and say, hey, I took a picture. I was on Haunted Mansion mm-hmm. at 3 p.m. and yep. I didn't get my picture. And they'll bring it up and yeah. you'll have to sift through 100 to 200 <laughs> pictures. That's happened to you, though. Many times. At Haunted Mansion, mm-hmm. a lot of times on Buzz. Mm-hmm. I feel like it happens oh, yeah, a right, lot. On Buzz too, right, right. So, not all the time. But no, it happens. but it's it's happened quite yeah. a few times, and you just have to remember the time frame because mm-hmm. you can't say, "Oh, it was in the afternoon," and it's like, mm-hmm. "Well, we're going to be going through thousands and thousands of pictures." <laughs> but if you go, you know what? It might have been between you know three p.m. and three ten or something, mm-hmm. or th- and three fifteen. You know, you you might be there for a little bit, but they'll they're they are patient and they will go through every photo to make sure you get yours. It's true. Yeah. Well, this is good. I yeah. thought. I think this is a good topic, and people love their photo pass. Uh, you know, the photographers do a great job, and you know, you have these memories forever. Yeah. So it's yeah. a great thing. Yeah. Did you have fun? Yeah. I like I, your choices. Well, thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I. It's funny because sometimes you forget. You know, mm-hmm. you mentioned one that I was like, oh yeah, that's right. You yeah. know, and it's cool. And and like I said, you know, I'll I'll post some of the ones that we that we talked about on our Instagram mm-hmm. and our Facebook uh, at Adventures in Weberland. Mm-hmm. Um, so you can check that out. And we will hang out with you on the next Adventures in Weberland. <laughs>